Hello everybody, welcome back. And if you haven't been here before, my name is Maggie. And today we're gonna to be making delicious but healthy brownies. So the secret ingredient for these brownies is zucchini. Um, so there is no oil in this recipe, but you would never be able to guess because these brownies are super decadent and really rich. So we're gonna go ahead and get started by peeling our zucchini and preheating our oven to 350 degrees. So once you've peeled your zucchini, it's time to grate it. And I'm just using this cheese grater, but I don't actually use it for cheese. I usually end up using it for veggies. So you're gonna use the small side of the grater. And I'm gonna go ahead and just cut my zucchini right in half because it'll be easier to work with. And just start grating your zucchini. So once you're done grating up the zucchini, you should have approximately two cups. The next thing I'm gonna add is one cup of almond butter, and I'm just using some unsalted, nothing added almond butter. Next, I'm gonna add a third cup of agave nectar, but you can add any kind of sweetener like maple syrup or coconut nectar. Next, we're gonna add two heaping tablespoons of cocoa powder, one teaspoon of baking soda, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, a half teaspoon of cinnamon. Next up, I've got a flax egg that I made. I made this beforehand, and this is just the equivalent of one egg, and about a fourth teaspoon of salt, and one fourth cup of whole wheat flour. You can also use all-purpose flour, or if you wanna make it gluten-free, you can use oat flour. And now we're just gonna mix all of these ingredients together. And after everything is mixed together, the last thing we're gonna add is one cup of vegan chocolate chips. And just give it one final mix, get those chocolate chips all incorporated in your batter. And now just go ahead and transfer all of your brownie batter into a baking dish. I am using an eight by eight glass baking dish that I have pre-greased super lightly with some coconut oil. And go ahead and pop your brownies in the oven. So you're gonna to wanna to bake these at 350 for about 45 minutes or until a toothpick comes out nice and clean from the center. Okay, so once you've taken your brownies out of the oven, you wanna just let them cool for an hour would be ideal, um, cause any less than that, they're still gonna be kinda of gooey. But this should be the end result. Super yummy, moist, amazing, delicious brownies. <laughs> 